Why would you want to do this to my family? He's a good person, so please, just come forward, please. An emotional plea to a killer. Fighting back tears, 17-year-old Rohan Burke's cousin tells PIX11 his family is completely torn apart over his death. My heart is just heavy right now. Like, I, I don't know how I'm going to go on without him. Just around 4 Monday afternoon, Burke was stabbed underneath his arm near East 17th Street and Avenue M in Midwood. He was able to get away from his attackers running into this pizza shop where he begged for help before collapsing in a pool of his own blood. He just come in, he starts screaming, like, call to 911, please. Jamil Shirnoff, who was also 17, was working behind the counter. He froze in shock when Burke came in. He just take out his T-shirt, all blood, like, start spraying all over the place. I need to help him. I give him some paper towel. Surveillance video shows at least three people walking away from the scene. At one point, you see one person passing off what appears to be a knife to a woman. The stabbing death of the teen is pulling on the hearts of people who live and work here. A few of them left behind candles and flowers. And before getting that call about what happened, Burke's family thought he was just hanging out with friends. He was kind to everybody, like a gentleman, a true gentleman. He was raised as a gentleman. And sources tell us that woman we were talking about in the surveillance video is being questioned by detectives as we speak, but so far no charges have been filed. Police are still looking for the teens you saw in that surveillance video. If you have any information on their whereabouts, call Crime Stoppers. The number's right there. It's 800-577-TIPS. We're live in Midwood tonight. Nicole Johnson, PIX11 News.